Dooley got an under edge on that. <laughs> <laughs> Price Hill. Oh, oh, hang on. Oh, it's no. been given. Well, it looked as though there was an under edge on that from Dooley, but the wicket is given. There is no reviews in this match. Strano cannot quite believe it, and neither can Josie Dooley, who shakes her head as she walks off. And the Renegades lose another wicket in the power play. Yeah, well, that is very disappointing. It was a fairly obvious bottom edge oh. there. This is two movements as well, and just... I mean, Strano sort of bailed on the... Uh, on the appeal and <laughs> she's very surprised when she sees the finger go up and you can see Josie Dooley very disappointed. She's fortunately you just need to just get off the field when those sort of things happen. There's not much you can do about it. Can't be changed. So Josie Dooley out LBW for, for two. Well, that's a heartbreaking way to go. And you just wonder as the umpire, you watch Molly Strana here, watch her reaction, probably gives it away. Well, as Lee hasn't even appealed. <laughs> Like, I think Molly's given it the oh oh. He, he should have scratched his nose, shouldn't have he? <laughs> yes, he should have. <laughs> Just don't know that situation. Can you call a batter back if you feel that they're not out? I don't know. Well, it's the umpires get paid to make decisions. True. You get some howlers throughout your career. O'Donnell, is she another victim? Yes. Molly Strano with victim 129 in the WBBL. She's closing in on Jess Jonathan and the Renegades are six for 61. Well, it's the curse of the surge. They've called the surge and uh, immediately O'Donnell's tried to get over there, didn't get out to the ball. Just not good enough with her feet to get to the pitch of that or even the length of that. Uh, an easy catch to Amy Smith there at mid off. Doesn't have to move too much. Uh, the Renegades lose another wicket as you see Mignon Dupree go straight up to and now she's gone press switch out for a second ball duck Strano back to the top of the charts equal with Jess Jonathan as the leading wicket taker in WBBL history oh she's catching up that one there Georgia Presswood but straighter, got across to the offside of the ball, trying to turn it onto the leg side. At least Fellani's nice and close to create that opportunity. Georgia Press, which just couldn't quite get the elevation. Easy catch for Elise Fellani. One, what is it? One, three, zero for Molly Strano now. The cheeky wee smile like, yes, thank you. Maybe got one a little earlier that she thought she didn't deserve, but the last two, <laughs> she certainly has. Hayward going back, hit on the pad, is this time out? Yes, it is. Strano has four. Well, she's probably gone back one too many times. Ella Hayward. Not sure if that one was missing leg. But uh, another quick look at this. She's just played across it, pushed back. That face going across to mid-wicket. Possibly is missing leg. A bit unlucky again, Ella Hayward, but needs to get forward on those. But uh, well identified from Molly Strano to make sure she's pitching it nice and full. Someone who prefers to go back. And Ella Hayward, she's got to go. She's out for two. So Sarah Coyd in game 100 comes to the crease. Here's that LBW decision. So probably fortunate the previous over and this time. She's deep in the crease. But it, lo it looked to be hitting the left pad. Yeah, I think it hit the front pad and then bounced onto the